Hi, welcome to this exacttrades.com video on the Schwab Street Smart Pro platform. In this video, I'm going to be going over the chart setup functions of this platform, show you how to add indicators and other items you may want on your chart. Let's go ahead and start by clicking on this chart button here. Just click the down arrow and go to new default chart. Here's the default chart that comes up. You can change your settings by clicking on settings and then general. This is where all your basic chart information is going to be. Whether you want an intraday chart, a daily, weekly, monthly. You can put in how many days of data you want. Let's put in two. And let's do a one minute chart. And a candlestick chart. And click OK. So now we have a candlestick chart. You can see it has these default Bollinger Bands as well as a moving average and stochastics down here. You can get into these studies by right clicking, clicking on studies. So right here in the right box here is everything that's on your chart and everything in the left here is everything that you can put on your chart. So let's go ahead and remove all these. You just do that by highlighting and clicking the left arrow. Click OK. So you can see we have a blank chart. If you don't particularly like the colors of the default, Again, you can go to Settings and Colors, and you can change the background. You can change any of the colors on any of these areas by highlighting the one you want to change and clicking on the color and selecting the color that you want. Let's change this background to gray, and you can change your line colors as well. Click OK. The black stands out better in my opinion, so I'm going to change it back to black. Okay, now let's add a couple studies. Right click, click on studies. Let's add two moving averages. You can just highlight moving average. Click the right arrow twice and it'll add two. Here's where you change your settings. We'll do this one as a 50 period moving average. And we'll make it light blue. Click OK. We'll do another moving average a 20 period moving average and we'll make this one yellow and let's add volume it's down here at the bottom click the right arrow and add McD put our settings in here and let's add the McD signal line and click OK so once you have all the indicators that you want in it's a good idea to save what you've done you just click File, Save as Template. We'll just call this Chart 1. So you can see there's multiple tabs up here. You can add tabs by right clicking and click Insert Tab. Let's call this one a 5 minute chart. And we want it to go after the Daily tab. Let's go ahead and copy settings over from this tab so it brings up the same chart. And click OK. Make sure you change the setting to a 5 minute chart so it matches the tab just by right clicking, going to chart interval, 5 minutes. Now the one thing about the Schwab Street Smart Pro under settings, like we went through before, general, if you only have one day of range on this, when the market opens it's very difficult to see because it's going to just start with that day. It's not going to give you past history. And so I would recommend having a minimum of two days range. As it progresses two to three hours into the trading day, you can switch that back to one. But it's going to be really difficult to see if it's on one when the market opens. So we'll change that to two and click OK. And a couple other features. You can zoom in by right clicking and click zoom in and use your mouse to scroll over the area that you want to zoom in. And to zoom back out, just right click and zoom out. To draw a trend line, you right click, insert trend line, change the color that you want. We'll leave this red. Click OK. And hold your mouse button and draw your trend line. You can also add support and resistance lines. Right click, we'll insert a support line here. Put it where you want and just click your mouse button. And add a resistance line right here 
You can put it wherever you want on your chart and click it. Now if you want to remove any of these, you just click on edit, delete all, and it'll give you options of what you want to delete. Let's delete the trend line, support line, and resistance lines and click delete. So that's pretty much the basics of setting up your chart on Street Smart Pro. In our next two videos, we'll be going over watch lists as well as linking your chart to a trade window and then additional advanced features of this platform. Visit our website at www.exacttrades.com. You can sign up for our free Movers and Shakers pre-market report. It's a report that's emailed to you every morning before the market opens with a minimum of 10 trade ideas each day. And while you're there, you can check out our full library of products and services.